smelly here. Did you fart? Excuse me? I would not excuse you. You mess, I be you no mess. How would I fart while chatting with a man? If mess hook you for man friend, would you fart? Sorry, oh, sissy koi koi. I beg, say what you want to say, I want to sleep. Oh, sorry. Now I know what's smelling. It's your heart. Richmond just put your heart on fire so the thing don't they burn. Can you imagine? See, I'm so over that guy. He was calling me to tell me he's coming back to Lagos after almost four months. Please, does he expect me to be waiting for him? I'm done, I beg. Wait, oh. Just now you were smiling like a frozen fish after talking to that boy. The same now, now you're talking like a female version of Tuno Trope. What is your problem, you this girl? For your information, I wasn't smiling. Please, just go away. I've had a long day. Bye. If you like off-light, I will still talk my own. You said you have moved on from Richmond. You lie. You lie. You have not moved on, Kunkun. The boy will show up now and use that his deep voice to totally you. And you will start smiling like the bumper of a B2 car. Don't call me a crazy girl. Don't call me a crazy lady. Your life is about to take a dramatic change in this house. Where? Take. So what's this for? The last time I checked, you can read, right? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, start reading what is in this paper you're holding. I, Tejumola Koka, mm -hmm. the son of Mr. and Mrs. Olawale Koka. That's right. She by son solemnly. Sister, what did I swear? Swear? What are you talking about? If you don't continue reading, Teju, what I will do to you will shock you. Here, my family swear that I will do everything possible to pass my next jump exam, mm -hmm. which include but not limited to staying away from from my staying away from my violin and piano. That's right. Reading my books without allowing any form of distraction, mm -hmm. and I only need. A, I only need a jump lesson so as to pass my exam. Mm -hmm. If I fit to pass my next jump, my sister has the right to send me out of the house to live on the streets. Mm. So you want to drop me on the streets? Yes. Mm, what if I get kidnapped and the kidnappers ask for ransom? Will you shut up and stop spilling rubbish out of your mouth? Kidnappers have not seen better people to kidnap. It is someone that cannot successfully pass his jump they want to kidnap. Do you think kidnappers kidnap a load like you? I said you should continue reading. Let's play with this one. If, if, if I refuse to comply to the terms of this agreement, mm -hmm. my sister has the right to employ any means necessary mm. to execute this agreement. Mm. This is my promise, so help me God. Yes, so help you God. Yeah. Sign. Sign. Sign, sign, sign. Sign under your name. But, but so what will happen if if I feel, if I fail my job and I refuse to leave the house? Mm -hmm. You want to know, Abby? 
See, according to the terms of the agreement you just signed, I have the right to employ every means necessary to eject you out of this house. Sister, what does that, what does that every means necessary mean? Uh -huh. You want to know? See, I will first of all go to Oshudi on that bridge, hmm? get boys and pay them 5,000 Naira only. They will come into this house and beat you mercilessly. After that, after they've beaten you black and blue, I will go to the government officials. Kai, kick against the discipline. They will come into this house and throw you out. One of their guys, my client, they will do that for me. Sister, do you want to do that your favorite brother? Hmm? You are my only brother. Yes, I will do worse. Hmm? You better be prepared for what is about to happen to you in this house. And for your information, you're starting a jam lesson soon. I don't want to do any jam lesson, you know. Before she can bring one ugly milk child, I'll come and use somebody for cane experiments. Good morning. Somebody on Kudon show. And somebody don't they shake like jellyfish? My name is Sister Lynn. Madam Topwell Joe, this guy doesn't know you are the one. Nice to meet you. Thank you. You must be passing coca. My goodness. How did you know? Why didn't you feel the correct information in the form you were given to feel? Um well, the person who recommended you um, spoke highly of you. Okay. Uh, but I do not trust people. I have a phobia for trusting people, so I tend to hide my identity as much as possible. Why is he hiding his identity? I've been your uncle they run for EFCC. Are you running from EFCC? I did not ask you to ask him, oh, Linda. Mm, I'm sorry, ignore that question. No, it's, 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 it's fine. Okay. It's fine. Um, I'm not running away from the EFCC. Um, I'm actually trying to stay alive, you know, um, village people. I'm the coca from Lagos. Are there village people in Lagos too? How did you know that? But, but look at you, there are village people everywhere. There are? Even the white people have their own version of village people. They do? Yes! See, in the UK where I grew up, you have some old women who do nothing but monitor everybody and everything. Mm. If you are happy, they call the cops on you. Oh. If you buy new clothes, they call the cops on you. Mm. You get a new car, old car, they call the cops on you. Even when you're having the moonlight, um, you know, you know what I mean, yeah? Mm. Exactly. They call the cops on you, mm. and they tell the police that you're trying to kill your spouse with midnight enjoyment. Mm. Now tell me, is there a better definition of? Village people? I can't think of any other better definition. Ah, so, what brought you here? Well, um... Um, I'm in my late 40s. Mm. I've lived in the UK for 20 years. Mm. Um, I've tried to marry a Nigerian wife over there, but... The young girls all have red eyes. Mm. All they want to do is um, marry you and, you know, take all your property once the paperwork becomes legal. Mm. And then they call the police at your slightest provocation. Mm. How about the white women over there? Akata? Never. Never. <laughs> I don't want to die young. Never. And what is going to kill you early? Starvation, me. Starvation. Listen. I'm not going to marry a woman who can't make me Amala and Abula. Huh? Some of it are no bella. Mm. Pounded yam. Almighty pounded yam. With your bell, we say, let me meet Jay. Ah! Sister Lee, mm. oh my goodness. And let me meet Jay Ko. And let me meet Alani. Whoa, this one has smoked Hiroko Trio. They said you're not ready yet. I am very much ready. Mm. And that's why I left the UK to come down to Nigeria. You know why? To look for a wife. Oh, so it's his wife you have come here to look for. I thought you said you were... Well, hang on, hang on. You were going to say something? Uh, uh, never mind. And how is the wife hunting going? <sighs> Sister Ling, mm. 
To be honest, it's not going pretty well. It's not going well at all. Mm. You see? They all look at me like, um, what is, a MAGA, Money Miss Road. They think because I say I'm from the UK, they can just get the knife and chop me off in bits and pieces, just like that. Can you imagine that? Mm. Nah. Can I please yab this your uncle for being so biased towards women? Please don't. Please let me yab it, just a little. I said no yabbing. Sorry, Stalin. Mm. Um, is it just two of us here or is it someone else? Yes. Right here with us is the universe. Universe? Mm. <laughs> okay. Okay. Right in this room, I have been communicating with the universe. And she's right here giving answers. She? Of course, yes. She? Yes. Oh, come on, Fritz. Come on, Fritz, Sister Lee. If the universe is going to be a person, mm. it will be a male. Like alpha male, male. Not just male. She. You see why I said you should allow me to have this your uncle? And why would you think the universe shouldn't be a woman? Oh, come on, friends. You shouldn't know that. You of all people should know that. Women are known and perceived to be the weaker sex, the weaker vessel. Okay? Yes. When God made them, I mean, uh, he didn't give them go 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 or suffragos. You know, Adam's apple? Uh, to bring your tongue? Mobile. Really? Yes. Adam's apple? Yes. That's about the only mistake that God made when he was creating a woman. He didn't give them Adam's apple to stop them from talking and saying whatever they want. Then wa 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 be waris. You know that song? But men talk with caution. Women, they flip out whatever they would say. Every day, every time, anyhow. Yabim. God bless you. Sorry? My name is to reach the level they are right, right now. And some random idiots just decide to steal it from me just like that. It's so painful. Relax, Tiwa. I'm sure you'll be able to get them back. Remember, everything happens for a reason. This might be God's way of getting you to your higher level of influence. If God thinks it's funny, I'm not laughing. It's not funny, it's painful. <laughs> The hacker just reached out. <sighs> Tiwiri is still saying peace and love. Peace and love key you dear. 500 k I don't, I don't even have 10 k in my account. Don't tell me you're thinking of paying that bastard. What do I do, Lola? What do I do? Don't worry, we'll think of something. How about we report it to the police? Police care? I don't want police to allow. But well, police is our friend. Police is your friend just on paper. But in reality, police is both your friend and your worst enemy. And what would you even tell them when you get to the police station? I will tell them that somebody kidnapped my social media handle and they are asking for a ransom. What kind of kangaroo statement is that? Well, are you coming with me or not? You know, I can't do this without you. Oh. I need your help. Tiwa, me, I don't want to get into trouble, though. I, I don't want police, while well, police is not my friend. Relax. You're the one that's supposed to be consoling me, but now I'm convincing you to go with me. Consoling you for what? Did somebody die? Can't you see that someone wants to kill my dreams and you're doing nothing about it? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, let's go. Are you satisfied now? Let me just say this last one. See his big nose like the dumping ground of used diapers. Ah, what? Now I am satisfied. <sighs> now that you're satisfied, can you tell me what you have for Mr. Benson here? Tell him there is no wife for him here in Nigeria. He has been living with his wife for over five years. Uh -uh. Are you whining, Mimi? Uh, sorry, Sister Lin? Um, this thing that you do, is it a joke? Because... <laughs> you keep speaking to yourself. He has a Nigerian neighbor who he has been dying to be with. 
But his perception about Nigerian ladies in the UK has prevented him from approaching her. Her name is Ebele. And she's a very good girl. And the funny thing is that she's also dying to be with you. If only you can erase this mentality about women generally and ask her out. She'll be glad to say yes to you. Wait, Sister Lee, don't pull my legs now. You saying Eberi has feelings for me? Yes, she has feelings for you. So go back to the UK and get your girl. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Sister Lynn. Gracias. Obrigado. Mm. Thank you. Thank you. Merci beaucoup, mademoiselle. Mm. Thank you very much. <laughs> Welcome back, sister. Ah, thank you. Thank you very much. How are you? I'm fine. Where's your sister? I, I don't know. She said she'll be back later. I don't know. And since when has she left this house? Uh, just five hours ago. What? Five hours? Is it five hours you called just? Ah, Mobe. Yeah. Five hours? And she didn't tell... Oh, my goodness. Ah, ah. Hello? Who is this? Uh -uh. Why would you be asking me who is this? Uh -uh. Who are you? Madam, watch your mouth. Oh. You are talking to... Before you land yourself in Kiki, you are talking to the officer of the law. Officer of the law? What do you mean by that? You don't even serve me. I am a police officer. Uh -uh. Police officer? Who is my sister and what are you doing with her phone? Yahoo hey. girl. Yahoo girl. Ha. Moku 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 moku. Hey. Let her come and come watch your sister from here. Ha. Please, where is your station? Police station. Ha. Hey. Did you? Did your sister tell you she was going to the police station? We are to uh, start talking. My TikTok and Instagram accounts were hacked, and now the blackmailer is sending me texts to send him 500k. Happy Ziaka Madini. So I decided that instead of him to continue blackmailing me, mm. I went to the police station to report the issue. But then they were tagging us as Yahoo Girls No Laptop. Oh, she, why GNL, Padusne? They were checking our phones, and then they didn't find anything implicating. But then they demanded that our family come bail us. Really? Yes. When all this was happening, why didn't you call me first before going to the police station? Because the said police is our friend. What about now? Are they still your friend? Sister, they are still our friend, though. Only their friendship is quite expensive. I've told you guys that you should always come to me first whenever you run into trouble. But no, you both think you're big adults now, right? Sister, I'm not big adult, so... Do you are speak for yourself, Chari? You don't have sense at all. But I'm not the ex-convict, am I? So who is not the ex-convict? What type of question is that? Who just came back from prison? Will you shut up your mouth? What are you saying? No siblings of mine will ever go to prison. All right? She was not in prison. She was just put behind the counter. I'm sorry, sister. I thought I had a return prisoner as, as a sister. If I hear prison from your mouth again, I'll slap that your silly mouth. I'm sorry. Tiwa, you should report yourself to mommy and daddy before going to bed tonight. Stop, head. I'm sorry for all that, I, that happened today. I didn't mean to cause all this trouble. It's fine. I just want you guys to remember that I am here for you anytime you need me. Look, I am both daddy and mommy now. You should talk to me first before anyone else. 
Can we do that? Let's just ask. I've had a long day. See you guys. Hey, hey, Tiba. Did you give me what you beans in prison? I hate beans is the best food for prisoners. Government. Uh, uh, see, why are you taking it so seriously now? Instead of you to be happy. She wasn't that um, Mandela and the Mobas Andre went to prison and they became presidents. Who knows? You can be our next ex convict female president now. Don't call me a crazy girl. Don't call me a crazy lady. I woke up like this. I'm here all you thinking I know you need a secret Don't tell that you see